wouldn't want to kill a defenseless old woman. That's obvious. Either to force her to reveal the whereabouts of the 200,000 or silence her forever on the grand murder. Mrs. Williams beckoned to me. I came. But Mrs. Williams is dead. Yes, I know. Well, how would a dead woman call you? There is an explanation, but you would not understand. My people say a murdered soul never rests until the murderer joins it. Within this cat is the spirit of Mrs. Williams. It will never rest until her murderer is found. I didn't kill her. I didn't. Get that cat out of here. I see you do not believe in fate, Mr. Grady. How did you know his name? I know all of your names. You are touched with the greed of money. I didn't kill her. Please believe me. But everything points to you. Even the cat. The cat knows. Take it away. I'll tell. I didn't kill Mrs. Williams, but I know who did. Are you hurt? <laughs> you who seek to discredit the cat would be wiser to seek its assistance. Terry, this case ought to be a cinch for you. All you have to do is watch him get murdered one by one. And when there's only one left, uh, besides me, that is, well, there's your killer. 